So hopefully by now you're on LinkedIn. Now let's make your profile really shine. Welcome to this episode of Be a Business Development Rockstar with Business Development Specialist, Nikki Llewellyn. Okay, so I have to admit that I spend a lot of time on LinkedIn. Try to be very productive with the time that I spend on there, but I run across so many profiles that some of my um, co- coworkers in the office were sitting talking about how challenge these profiles look and how important it is to have a strong presence on LinkedIn. And so I thought I'd do a show today to talk about the key things that you can do to polish up your LinkedIn profile and the things that are just really obvious that stand out. If people are on there like myself pretty regularly, we're seeing these things and it and it doesn't do anything to enhance your yourself if, if those things aren't representing you in the best light. So let's talk about a couple of them. First of all, do you have a professional headshot on LinkedIn? Please don't be one of those people that has you with a beer in your hand or you and your dog, as much as I love dogs, your dog next to you and your LinkedIn profile, this is a professional platform. So that picture needs to be professionally done. And for those um, friends of mine that are professional photographers, I definitely want to give them a plug to go find your best professional photographer and talk with them to get a headshot. But you don't necessarily need to have a professional um, do a headshot in order for it to be a nice picture on LinkedIn. You can take a an iPhone and do a picture in order to make it a better picture than something that you would have on Facebook or something. So that picture is really important. The second thing that I recommend is there's one line, and I've talked about this before, called your professional headline on LinkedIn. It's one line that you have 140 characters to stand out. And that that line is really important because if someone sees you in some search results, all they see is your your face, your picture, and that professional headline. So you really want to make that glowing. You want to make that um, speak about you so that people actually click on it. So don't use that space just to put your title because your title is already in your LinkedIn profile. Make that that one line really shine. Now, once you are in your profile or once someone's you know clicked on you and they've entered into the profile, the very first thing that they see is your summary section. And I see so many people that don't fill this out and this is the number one place that you have to engage someone, which is the point of LinkedIn. You're on there because you want people to engage with you. And so what I would love for you to do is go look at your summary section and write write some things about you, like welcome people to, you know, reach out to you, thank them for stopping by your page, share with them what you're working on, goals that you're working on right now, be specific, like say, hey, here's certain types of companies that we've been working with and I would love to get introductions or referrals to these certain types of companies. Share a lot about yourself. And this would be the section that you can mention something about your dog or things that you love to do. And people do reach out to me because I've got, you know, I'm very passionate about dogs and being involved in the humane society and my English Bulldog skateboards. I throw that in there and sometimes people will reference that, but that's a great place to let your personality shine and let people really engage with you. A couple other things for credibility. I highly recommend filling out your education and your uh, career background. So don't just have, you know, if you've currently been at your, your position now for four years, and you don't have anything else there, I would say that sometimes that may hinder your credibility. So list out other places that you've worked and other experience that you've had or credentials that you have or or certifications and things like that to really build your profile and make that shine. So my challenge for you is if you have one of those profiles without a picture or it's kind of boring, you're not boring. So don't make your you know LinkedIn profile look that way. Really polish it up. And it starts with just a couple of key things that we mentioned today in this video. Have fun with it. Thank you for watching this episode of Be a Business Development Rockstar with Nikki Llewellyn. For more great information, visit the Rainmakers website at GoRainmakers.com. Also browse the other shows found right here at Toledo Biz TV Shows.